Okay you guys welcome to iReview products. This is going to be basically a quick, t quick um, t hint to you guys um, on what to do before you actually jailbreak your um, iPod 3rd gen or um, iPhone 3GS or, the, or your iPad using Spirit. The jailbreak that's expected to be released today. Actually it was expected to be released yesterday but long story short the reason why it's been postponed is the iPhone dev team want you to be able to back up your SHSH files um, just in case if you encounter any sort of problems with your device and you'll be able to do a restore okay so yeah basically guys you need to back up your SHSH files and the reason behind it is um, basically you guys right now that are on 3.1.3 you're unable to downgrade download sorry sorry downgrade your um, firmware to 3.1.2 and the reason behind it is Apple have stopped signing off their old firmware 3.1.2 so most of you guys have probably tried it using iTunes and you get the message saying unable to um, unable to downgrade as this device is not eligible for this build um, so yeah just say you guys Apple release 4.0 officially tomorrow um, and you have your SHSH files um, you'll be able to downgrade back to 3.1.3 or 3.1.2 for that matter um, and that's the best thing about it basically SHSH files when when you grab a copy of it um, basically it'll be put onto um, Cydia's server so every time you do a restore um, Cydia would be informed and Cydia will let you do the restore to whatever firmware you want so, so it's a really good thing to have and it's a very important thing to have for you guys that are that are currently on 3.1.3, I bet you wish you've already had it, so you could downgrade to 3.1.2. Nevertheless, Spirit is expected to be released today, and it's going to be available for the iPod Touch 3rd Gen 3GS and 3.1.3 and the iPads. Um, and I will be demonstrating the jailbreak to you later on today, once the jailbreak is officially released um, on my 3GS. But before I go ahead and go into get into all that. I want you guys to back up your SHSH files. Um, now I need you guys to download this program, um, which can links will be provided in the description for you guys, so don't worry about it. Now straight away you'll get a warning message up saying you do need an internet connection too for this, and you do require your device to be connected to your computer. Now remember guys, one device only, and it must be in recovery mode. Now if you don't know how to step put your device into recovery mode, basically you hold your menu key and your power key down for about 40 to 50 seconds um, and then you'll be in restore mode now if you don't know how to do it already please check one of my other videos guys and I'll explain how to enter into recovery mode now okay so once you've gone by that first message you'll get a you'll be pop prompted with another message advising you if you have your if you have java installed onto your computer if you haven't you will need to install java guys but if you do you can just go ahead and click on yes now providing that you've entered recovery mode correctly your device should should look um, exactly like this image there um, that's basically a symbol that you're into recovery mode if you don't click on recovery mode it'll give you the explanation hold power plus home button continuously until this image is displayed basically um, on your iPhone or iPod touch so yeah, once you're into recovery mode, you click on grab my SH SH blobs. They'll say the, the software will do its thing, um, and then it'll ask you to go ahead and save it. Now, um, I've already saved this, guys, but I'll save it again for you. Um, let's see, one, two, three, and there you go. It's saved the um, the a copy on my desktop, and it's also sending a ticket to Cydia, stating that. Oh, well basically passing on your SHSH files to Cydia so if you ever ever encounter sort of problems you'll be able to restore to whatever firmware you want then you'll be prompted with another message saying done three um, your SHSH floods were successfully saved thank you um, etc now you can close out of all, all that um, and there you go and um, this is um, what your um, your SHSH blobs actually look like it's it means possibly nothing to you whatsoever 
but this is what it looks like anyways guys keep a keep a uh, keep a copy of your SHSH blobs because you will need it possibly in the near future um yeah this is part one of the spirit jailbreak that's expected to be released today guys so please stay tuned subscribed um, onto my channel and yeah please watch out for part two thanks guys bye now bye